North Texas teacher is in his 40th day of fasting to draw attention to problems between police and black communities. Fox 4 Sean Rabb says Curtis Ferguson's sacrifice is catching on with some of his students. I'm on a hunger strike uh, slash fast. Carter High School art teacher Curtis Ferguson. Today is day 40 for me. 40 days without food. <laughs> Fed up. <laughs> the violence across America pitting minorities against police. I'm trying to bridge the gap between communities and law enforcement. And black on black crime. Ferguson fasting to protest. Three law enforcement officers killed nationwide in the line of duty in the last 30 days. And three of his former students who've been killed in Dallas since last August. It's about the youth. It's about law enforcement. Teaching young men in his Man Up mentoring program that all lives matter. And the goal and objective is to let them know that your life has value. This is not the first time Ferguson's sacrificed to draw attention to social issues. I got an N-word free campaign I'm trying to get after. Ten years ago, Ferguson fasted to protest the N-word's use, sparking conversations on radio and college campuses. Now, it's about more than a negative word. But Ferguson's had to swallow some negative comments. Calling me a sellout, saying that, um, uh, I'm sleeping with the pigs and uh, just a lot of derogatory things about uh, my intent and my goal. Well, I know that when there's a problem, indeed, there's no break. There's no time to risk. J.B. on Jackson, one of the many Ferguson's mentoring. To be honest, I used to be a little knucklehead. I used to hang around the cool kids, but Man Up has got me out of that. It got me to know that it's time to grow up. It's time to get ready for the real world. And to see past the color of anger against police. When we think about that, I think about the black on black crimes, it gets to us because it's like, I wish this wasn't happening. Do you share with other folk how you feel about certain issues? It all starts off with a little seed. You have to plant a little seed inside of the conversations and make that seed grow. What the teacher has been doing, not just in art class, but with his actions. And the goal and objective is just to keep trying to make a difference and save a life. Sean Rabb, Fox 4 News. A little more about Mr. Ferguson and his feelings for police. His brother is a major in the Hampton, Virginia Police Department. Mr. Ferguson has lost 57 pounds over the past 40 days and hopes his physical transition will be symbolic of a greater transition he hopes we'll see in the community.